Ms. Komal Chabaria, she'll be talking about the changes that she has observed in her career uh, from uh, the radio artist, voice artist to a method actor. And I, I believe it will be very, very helpful to our students because many of these students are interested in getting into the films and various forms of media. So her first hand experience will be very helpful to all of us. Yeah. So, Komal ma'am, over to you. Thank you so much, uh, Dr. Javed, and uh, a very warm welcome to everyone uh, at Navrashna University, whoever is watching this. Uh, it's my greatest pleasure to be here on this platform addressing you all. And uh, whatever I'd be talking about uh, or, uh, you know, maybe sharing my experiences uh, about cinema, I hope it helps uh, some of you, if not all of you. <laughs> so. I would like to uh, start from my journey, how I began. Um, this was around 14 years ago. I did a radio jockey um, course for uh, about three to four months. This was because I was really interested in, uh, I, was, I was a very talkative person, I still am. But then I had a good voice and people recognized and they were like, you know, uh, my children were grown up, not very grown up, but then they used to go to school. I had a lot of time in hand and I wanted to do something creative because um, you know, it was like your energy is always, your creative energy is always bubbling to do something. So um, I did this course and uh, very soon I got this uh, job in a radio station, which was uh, just for women, talk radio station, which was a very new concept in India uh, those days. It was around 14 years ago in 2007 or yeah, 2007. So I joined there um, uh, as a producer. And uh, since I didn't have any kind of work background or uh, professional background as such, except that I was a voice artist, I was I was trained and I used to dub for films those days. They hired me as a producer and they said, you just get the hands uh, on how radio works and then probably we'll give you a show. So fortunately, after a year or two, after producing a lot of shows, morning show, evening shows, uh, afternoon show, there was this celebrity show, which I used to produce. Uh, produce was uh, producing is more like you know generating content for the show and obviously you know contacting the celebrities or maybe their managers and putting them on air coordination and stuff so um, very happy uh, i was really enjoying uh, that work but then of course after a year or two i i mean i did want to go ahead and i fortunately got a show on on air which was a retro show uh, I'm very fond of retro music and I had a no lot of knowledge about uh, retro songs because ever since a child, I used to just listen, keep listening to radio because my mom was always listening to radio. So I was uh, naturally, uh, you know, I had this flair or bent towards music and songs. And I did this show for three years uh, in radio and side by side, uh, voicing bhi chal raha tha, in the sense, uh, dubbing chal rahi thi for English and Hindi films, which was again, was creatively very satisfying. After that, uh, post that uh, for around five years being in radio, I wanted to move on, progress ahead. So I got this job at uh, Sub TV as a channel voice. Um, that was uh, now as a channel channel voice, you just have to go there. They give you the uh, the promo is written for you. Uh, you have to just voice. Like I don't know how many people would remember, but then I can give you an example. Um, you are watching Tarak Mehta ka ulta chashma, yeah, Tarak Mehta ka ulta chashma. Dekhiye, the rose rat saree at baje, sirf sab par. Those things. So, so I did that for around three, three and a half years. But because since it was not a very time consuming job, uh, although creatively satisfying, I wanted to do something else. And fortunately, again, uh, I was at the right place at the right time, if you say so. There was this method acting school, which was uh, very close to my house. I joined there. Uh, to train uh, in acting because, again, the creative juices were overflowing and I wanted to try my hand in acting as well. I got trained. I was working over there and um, giving auditions for various roles uh, for a mother, as a mother, or uh, you know, as a uh, maybe a doctor or an engineer, kind of those kind of roles. And again, I got lucky. I used to get a lot of work. I did my first film, uh, uh, Padmavat, which was uh, uh, it was just by 
not by luck uh, of course yeah it could be i could say it could be by luck so shruti mahajan the casting director she showed my pictures to bansali sir and he said yeah i want this actor she fits the role so just on the basis of my look uh, i was cast in the film as the begum um, jalaluddin's wife and slowly slowly from there onwards i started getting a lot of um, films and uh, web series web shows advertisements of course they were all on so that's how this is this is like my very quick journey uh, how it all started so acting happened 5 years ago now um changing if i go on the topic uh, which says that uh, shift in uh, cinema changing times uh, of cinema or shifting tides of cinema uh, what i have noticed is that um, uh, you know cinema has evolved it has uh, times have changed um, actors acting has changed uh, initially uh, initially what i feel is that acting was more about performing uh, of course i um, i dare not say that they were not uh, uh, feeling at that point of time but nowadays it is more trained acting it is more people are people are aware that you know i want to do this in life i want to become an actor what do i do let me get trained or let me do theater but then where do you find such platforms do you i mean you just can't go one day ki chalo main theater join karti hu and you know aap actor ban gaye aur train ho gaye waisa nahi hota hai uh, so it's more uh, i think it's more um, um ek wo, uh, you know ek nuances ya ek field ban gaya hai jaise aap train ho kar agar aap aap aaye hain people take you seriously and your acting has improved because you feel that person's the character that you're playing obviously you you're going to play a certain character who has a lot of baggage emotional uh, emotionally how how is that person so there are a lot of jargons in uh, in terms of uh, acting course if you do a certain acting course there are you know a lot of um, things that you may hear um it's more feeling of the emotions of the character when when you say that i'm a trained actor you know that you are going to play a certain role and to get into that character's feelings uh you do a certain exercise a certain you do a lot of exercise it's just not one it it's like um you know when i got trained it was um and i came to know about a lot of nuances about uh, the, the jargons the basic things is like what's the back story uh, about the character's life what is his back story what is the character's education or her his or her relationships how has he been uh, as a son as a daughter as a daughter as a mother kaise unhone you know ye sari cheeze jo hai वो लोग एक्सप्लोर करते हैं वो आपको सिखाते हैं ट्रेन करते हैं वट इज द वर्ल्ड व्यू ऑफ दैट कैरेक्टर लाइक एज अ पर्सन एज कोमल आई मे बी अ डिफरेंट पर्सन विद अ डिफरेंट वर्ल्ड व्यू बट इफ आई एम प्लेइंग अ सर्टन कैरेक्टर से सावित्री यू नो इन आधे अधूरे विच आई डिड आई आई डिड थिएटर या ऑफकोर्स आई मीन आई आई ऑल्सो डिड थिएटर फॉर टू ईयर्स एंड सो टू गेट इन टू द इन टू द इंट्रिकसीज ऑफ सावित्री वॉट शी मस्ट हैव गॉन थ्रू इन लाइफ you know we have to develop all that it doesn't because komal is different from savitri so how does she get into the skin of savitri to to feel what she feels uh, you know what are the circumstances that led her into doing uh, certain making certain choices like say for in that character in that story uh, you know what are her sensibilities what is the background that is um, uh, savitri is from like if I, i'm i'm a mumbai girl and i'm you know i'm born and brought up over here so i mean obviously i will my upbringing and my background is would be different from savitri's so um, you know to get into that you have to get trained what are the circumstances um, that uh, that led to this character taking certain uh, certain step or a choice usne ki ye kyun kiya usne aisa so you all this has to um, you have to build or and obviously the script gives you everything um the the director tells you everything the writer tells you about uh, the character because they are the people who have thought about the story they are the people who have created this person uh, so script uh, is your oh, my bab <laughs> like you know uh, you have to get a lot of um, it feeds you basically what that character is uh so as an actor you depend a lot on uh, on the script and of course the director because he has a certain view ha ha yaar 
so uh, nowadays any acting classes if you join uh, they have these some of the other exercises like you know they will teach you about um, uh, you know what is the character devel how do you develop the character it's called char- character development what is the emotional memory um, uh, you know for the character i have i've very often have come across this uh, term which is known as black hole <laughs> and black hole is nothing but you know the the deepest or the untapped or uh, unexpressed emotions which every human being has now if you are a human you know so instant gratification agar dekha jaye agar bola jaye to sab log ko jaldi se entertainment chahiye uh us hisab se they have to generate uh, uh, you know these quick stories uh, apart from the ott apart from the films or um, uh, bade parde par film mein release karna ya uh, you know youtube pe youtube another channel uh, that uh, you know it produces sketches which are like you know the 8 minutes 7 minutes ki choti choti stories hai quick stories uh, thoda sa humor hoga thoda sa reality hogi and you uh, quickly make this uh, story you know, which is so real life slice of life jisko aap slice of life jisko aap keh sakte hain fat se wo log bana lete hain produce ho jata hai ek do din mein shoot ho jata hai and it's there uh, people are watching it like lakhs and 10 lakhs and, um, and look at the number of views that these uh, uh sketches are getting you know and the huge popularity uh, that the actors are getting the directors are getting so nowadays with the mobile phone i think again this is a change in uh, cinema if i might say so not cinema but at least uh, for actors and the audiences is that um, you know it's, it's a very quick gratification jo hai aapko apne mobile ki tarah although also that it is a personal medium nobody is there to disturb you you know aap apne hi hath mein aapke jo you know the dream world that you want to be in you know for this for those few hours you just have it in, in your hand even on the go whether you're traveling or you're uh, you know you know sitting at home alone you just have it you can download it keep it and watch it even while you're flying you know it's it's such a, a wonderful thing that times are changing and audiences prefer watching it when they are Uh, on the go or when they are by themselves in fact nowadays they are almost always by themselves only even if you are sitting you are going to a party they are just watching something so i think ye instant gratification ka zamana hai and that's how uh, cinema has changed and that's how acting has changed um and i in, in fact when i see uh, so many actors when i see these uh, online platform uh, online mein jitne sari stories dekhti hu ya web series ya sketches dekhti hu we have such good actors you know they they re- they really know what they're doing they're so well versed with the script i mean i'll hardly i'll i won't see uh, somebody doing bad acting because they are just there they have become that person also ek aur trend jo maine personally dekha hai uh, is the casting is so perfect now all the credit goes to a casting director in fact uh, recently i heard uh, somewhere uh, a big director i think anurag kashyap sir jo hain wo keh rahe the ki uh, casting director when he nails uh, the perfect cast the 30% of your film is made you know so it's so easy to cast uh, uh, you know the perfect person the perfect actor and your 30% of your story is done um, so yeah casting directors have stepped in um at the right time again changing tides of indian uh, of cinema jahan par casting directors ka bahut bada hath hai the casting process is so huge and it's so difficult i have seen it personally you know they struggle the casting directors are struggling to get actors struggling in the sense jaise um, directors zyada tar aam taur pe uh, aisa dekha gaya hai ki agar aap uh, jis profession ke actor ko aap jis part ke liye यू नो कास्ट करना चाहते हैं वो लोग रियल प्रोफेशनल्स को लेकर आते हैं आजकल लाइक इफ यूर इफ यूर बैले डांसर दे विल गेट अ रियल बैले डांसर इफ यूर यू नो ऑपरा सिंगर दे गेट दिल कास्ट रियल ऑपरा सिंगर अ डॉक्टर अ डेंटिस्ट लाइक आई हैव सीन अ लॉयर and they all want to do this because uh, you know they all want to uh, have, everyone has that creative uh, uh, instinct i think every human being has and they're just waiting to share it so they cast them and they're so easy with the role 
uh, it's amazing to watch, uh, you know, real professionals uh, doing uh, acting uh, in in certain films or web series. Again, web series, ये सारा जो trend है, ये web series से लेकर ही आया है मुझे ऐसा लगता है. Uh, YouTube जो platform हम लोगों को मिला है, uh, you know, ये सारी चीजें इतनी easily available हो गई हैं. But still, there is a lot of hard work. There is a lot of effort that these casting directors put in casting a certain um, actor. this is what i have um, that i have seen uh, you know i've seen a casting director struggling <laughs> to cast uh, uh, actors and moreover there is a demand for such you know the directors have they actually go and give them instructions give uh, casting directors these instructions that humko real life ka ye banda chahiye hai you know if it's a mountaineer aap सच का सच में जिसने माउंटेन क्लाइंबिंग की है उसको लेकर आते हैं बिकॉज डायरेक्टर का आधा जॉब हो जाता है हैव टू ट्रेन हिम ए ही डजेंट हैव टू टीच हिम कि आप ऊपर जाकर क्या फील करेंगे या यू नो स्पेशली इन दीज एड्स एंड स्टाफ लाइक आई गेट आई कम अक्रॉस अलॉट ऑफ दीज जैसे कास्टिंग कॉल्स होते हैं तो दे एक्चुअली आस्क फॉर सच प्रोफेशनल सो इट्स अमेजिंग इट्स वंडरफुल टाइम टू बी एन एक्टर my final words uh, is uh, that yeah we are uh, we are in a great time uh, as an actor i feel we are uh, in, a, in moving with the times and we are in a, in a great space uh, to be acting in anybody can become an actor this is my 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 you know parting words is that anyone can become an actor provided you are trained you have the inclination you have the patience <laughs> to get the right role <laughs> yeah that's it wonderful wonderful thank you thank so you. much Thank, Thank you so, you so much. much.